Hello and welcome to iWin, the International Winners Information Network. Hi, I'm Jennifer Solly and I'm so excited to share this video with you today. Now, if if we're not connected yet, let's connect on Facebook, www.facebook.com forward slash Jennifer Solly. Now, let's go ahead and dive into this video training today. What happened was, you know, in the morning, uh, it's Saturday morning, May 10th. It's about 8.20 a.m. right now when I'm recording this video. And, uh, you know, I was on Facebook doing some updates and, and things like that. And it was time to go over and check my email. So once I went over to check the email, I found this horrific letter. Let me go and take you over there so you can see that right now. All right, so here it is. Follow up for system PHP upgrade for my site on Gator, on HostGator. So dear valued customer, we have successfully upgraded your website's version of PHP. Great. <laughs> While we have taken every opportunity to ensure JenniferSalhe.com has been configured with the correct version of PHP, we would ask that you take this opportunity to double check your websites. If you do happen to notice issues with the newer version of PHP, you may revert to the previous version of PHP by following the instructions given in the following knowledge base article. Here's the link, the prior version of PHP being 5.2.17. We thank you for your business and hope you enjoyed this update to your service. Alrighty, great, so I thought I'd better go ahead and check to see what's going on with my website. So I enter jennifersolly.com. Oh, and look what happens. Not good. Fatal error. Call time passed by reference has been removed. If you would like to pass argument by reference, modify the declaration of apply filters in Home 1, Musgro 1, publication, blah, 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 blah. Okay? So, my website is currently down any traffic that is being driven to this site is now being driven to a bad link. Can you imagine how much money could be wasted if you didn't monitor your email, if you didn't monitor your sites? Managing your business is number one and you can do this from anywhere, from any beach in the world you can check your email send an email check your sites check your back offices alright okay so anyway we're screwed here we need to figure out what the heck to do so we're back here at the email it says to click on this link okay so we click on the link boom here we go host gator hello the support portal we're going to um, the PHP configuration plugin and if you ever encounter problems with the way your server handles PHP packages it may be helpful to view and or modify your service PHP configurations so here we are and it's going to tell us what to do we're going to go ahead and get that done right now so the PHP configuration plugin in cPanel allows you users and shared and reseller service to the to P. okay so we're going to log into cPanel alright here we go Let's get over there to cPanel. Okay, we're going to log in. All right, great, we're in. And now we are going to the next step. In the advanced section, click on the PHP configuration icon. All 
right in the PHP configuration okay here we are down here in advanced you see that and advanced and then we're going to click on the PHP configuration here it is okay click on that All right, that brings us to another page. Let's go ahead and see what our next step is. So, navigate to the directory for which you'd like to update the PHP version. From the drop-down menu, select a specific version of PHP or one of the following options. And then click Update. Alright, so let's take a look back over there. Um, all right. There we are. We're going to revert to 5.2. Okay, account PHP preference updated and the file extension will be processed by PHP 5.2 for this account. Alright, great. Sounds like that's a winner. Alright, go ahead and log out. And of course, it takes a few minutes uh, in order to process. So it's 8.27 a.m. right now. And I'm going to go ahead and pause this video. And then we'll check and see if it reconfigures. Matter of fact, let's check it out right now. JenniferSolly.com. Oh, well, that was quick, wasn't it? Great. Absolutely wonderful. We are back up and running on the old PHP. Great. So here is my site, Online Business Solutions. Matter of fact, that's www.jennifersalhe.com. And come on over and make it an R, uh, do an RSS feed on it. Check it out. Leave a comment. I've got some uh, content and some videos and uh, some great information on, on how to make money online, how to work from home, and things like that. And also come on over here to my Facebook group. Okay, so, <clears throat> sorry, didn't mean to sound so drab with that, but, um, you know, training is a little bit drab sometimes. I just want to say, wow, we got that done, and just in the nick of time, because look, that email came out at what time? one day ago alright today is Saturday so it came out Friday and um, if I was sending paid traffic to that site guess what would have happened they would have all bounced all that traffic a whole day's worth we're talking about hundreds and hundreds of, of clicks in one day, in 24 hours, you could have got a thousand, a thousand clicks. Just depends. Could get a hundred clicks. You could get a thousand. Could get, you know, I've seen people get 700 clicks in a day. I've seen people get, you know, major, major clicks in in a day. And you know that results in your leads and your prospects and all that good stuff. But we're not going to go into that now. Just as you know, if your site is looking funny. <laughs> then it may need to be configured. So this is Jennifer Salhi with IWIN, the International Winners Information Network, signing out for now. Until the next video. Oh, remember, yes, click on that link below. Uh, go ahead, click on that link below that's going to take you to my um, video channel on YouTube okay so that's my video channel on YouTube you see I've got 54 subscribers so go ahead subscribe to my video channel it has over 11,800 views at this time 
and uh, we've got about 300 videos so we'd like to see you see you back alright signing out